everybody. Going to do a review here on this uh, BR800 steel blower. Um, I'm just going to tell you guys right up front, if you're thinking about a blower, I'd go with a backpack blower personally. And I'm glad I did. Um, I love it. Um, do I still have the handheld? Yes. And uh, I will go get that right now. Um, it's an original. It's just a little tiny BG56 um, that I have. And I have a BG... Or is it a fifth straight 56C? I don't even remember. It's set up as a shredder back right now. But that is over at uh, home. Um, you might be questioning yourselves, why do you got two blowers over here and one at home? <laughs> even I don't even know why I did that. I should have bought two of these. Kept one here and one over there, but uh, I would have been out uh, 1200 bucks but this thing is a house of a blower um, BG 56 it's good for blowing equipment off like the baler and stuff this was my main blower up until like a year ago I think I'll have to look at my receipt if I can find it but it was a year ago um this month, I think I bought this thing. Um, I like it. I like it so much, and I, I've heard that you can get like different, different tubes and everything. I think you can even get like a, a tube that narrows down even further than uh, like what this one does. I don't even think I need that, as you guys have seen in the video. Um, I love how it's got this cruise control on it for like blowing long uh, yards and stuff like that. And then you just simply, you know, push it down to stop, shut the thing off, and then it, you know, springs right back to run again. Um, the straps, I love them. Um, and I love how it's got like this uh, big, I don't know what the heck it, it is for like a spring kind of thing to help keep take some of the shock away from you and everything or no that's just a, just a shroud isn't it i don't really know my terms guys um but yes i bought it from ag pro um because i think we were going there to get something for the grain drill last winter and i just my sister was like oh why don't you go to koya's and look at them i'm like i don't need to look i know what i want i'm gonna buy the thing now okay so that's what i did done deal i got the wrench over at home i've never looked at the air filter and i probably should um yeah that's on some kind of a a spring there um but this choke here, I like it, how you just flick the choke and then uh, it kicks itself off automatically. I like that. Not sure what these little guys here are for. I think they're for carburetor. Um, yeah, low and a, a, low and a high. Um, never messed with them, I don't plan to. Primerable bowl. Just kind of pump it till you kind of feel uh, gas start to go in it. And just like that, uh, I don't know if you can see gas in there. Used to be able to. Yep. You can see the gas kind of sloshing around in there. Um, you prime that every time you go to start this thing. I love, and this is what I wish the little blowers had, a massive gas tank. Man, just big. I just love it. 
Um, it's just, it takes two cycle gas, just like everything else. Um, but uh, I was, they were, they were trying to talk me into the one that was just like this, but it had the easy start on the side. And I was like, no, because knowing me, I'll probably break the darn thing. And then uh, it, uh, you know, will never run again. It's talking in terms of like weight and stuff. It's, you know, it's got some weight to it. Um, you know, you go to, you go to put the thing on and you know, I'm, you know, five, seven, uh, 160. I mean, there's, you know, how, you know, standing straight up the, the pipe, it don't even hardly, you know, it wants to touch the ground, but it just, but it don't quite there yet. Um, I've never had to adjust and I think, oh, there's something I didn't even know about this thing. You can adjust this trigger, how far forward and back or back you want it. And I've never had to adjust it since I've owned it. I mean, I'm, it's, you know, perfect. I hear guys, you know, you know, oh, you can do tricks and stuff with these, you know, blow them out of corners. I haven't gotten there yet. I'm still new at this. But I'm happy with it so far. So if you guys are interested in blowers, stuff like that, um, get yourself a good handheld and I'll do a review on my other blower um, here soon. And uh, we'll uh, go see what else we can get into. Thanks for watching guys. Stay tuned for next time.